Greetings, everyone, and welcome to Truth Council 23 with me, Truth Nunez, and our spiritual council. Welcome, everybody, to today's collective energetic read. Welcome to our day ones. Welcome to our new subscribers and everyone in between, my lovies. We are almost at 5,500 subscribers. We are growing. We are flowing. We are popping. We are pop, lock, and dropping. <laughs> I love when you come in with the pop drock, the the drock, the drock. You're coming in with the drock, my lovies. I don't know what the drock is to you, but the drock is coming in. For some of you, the drop. For some of you, the drip. For some of you, you're coming in with the drip, my lovies. Mumbai cooch. I know that's slang nowadays for you look good, my lovies. On your mama, on your hood, you look fly. Look, you look good. Lucas, touch their swag. Wish they could, my lovies, because you look fly, you look good. My lovies, y'all, y'all feeling nice? <laughs> you're, you're looking nice for some of you. You're looking like Posh Spice for some of you. For some of you, you're looking like uh, Ice Cube for some of you. Ice Cube is coming in. Um, But what's up, my lovies? Dang, y'all be fly, my lovies. Too fly for a white guy or for white girls, my lovies. Anyways, with curls, my lovies. Anyways, and your little girls, my lovies. All right. <laughs> <laughs> y'all are cute you're coming in with cute energy i like it my lovey what's up everybody what's up emily what's up everybody what's up veronica's coming in kathleen wants to jump in kelvin wants to jump in calvin wants to jump in kevin all the k's be present for some of you just be cautious with some of our k brethren and sisterin because Catherine, you know, is coming into a Lutheran wants to come in for you. Anyways, welcome everybody. Welcome. We are 5,500 strong and growing and flowing, my lovies. Um, we are so honored, grateful, and thankful to have you all to read this uh, collective energetic read for you. Again, keeping in mind we're reading collective energies. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Kennedy and Kenneth. You are and forever will be the masters of your experiences and Corrine um, and Christine. Actually, I had a dream about Christine for some of you. Uh, Christine, my lovies. There's a, this could be you as Christine. There could be a Christine around you um, that is emotionally going through some shifts in her life. Uh, this is a bride. This is not a bride. She's not a bride, but for some of you, this could be a bride. This is someone that's already married for some of you. And um, she's she's going through some shifts in her life. It's really beautiful, but um, Christine is looking for her mama's support for some of you. Uh, this could be you as Christine. This could be you as Christine's mother. Uh, Christine is looking for support, my lovies. But um, I had a dream about Christine and her two sons uh, for some of you or Tucson for some of you someone could be from Tucson for some of you someone can have two sons um, but um, that energy came in uh, for you as well but um, welcome to everybody again we're, we're reading collective energies uh, take what resonates leave what doesn't if you need to book a private read you could do so by looking at the pinned comment or the description box um, because the pinned comment takes time especially when your sister friend's doing other things and then I have to check back and I'm like oh crap it already uploaded um, but uh, yeah but uh, we'll pin it for you or you can check in the description box and you can find the Calendly link to book a private read Thank you so much for your bookings, my lovies. Thank you for your likes, for your shares, for your comments, your subscribes. Uh, thank you to all of your family. For some of you, you come here, your family members come here, your friends come here. Um, and I'm just thankful to be your channel, my lovies. Um, I thank you for your comments, again, for your sharing of your stories, for your likes. Someone told a little bit of a lie in a situation and someone spied. For some of you, um, this energy was present. <clears throat> ooh, ooh, they tried to attack it right as it came in. Um, they didn't like it, my lovies. We're going to clear those throat chakras anyway. Um, uh, someone lied and said uh, they they got a reading done. Someone, the way it came in in the preliminary, they totally lied. Someone got a, a reading done by a reader and they completely lied about what the reader said. I don't know why. Someone's also talking about giving someone head. I don't know. This person gave you head or someone gave someone head and someone just wants to get ahead in life by, by doing sexual favors. For some of you, um, it also came in someone slept their way to the top. So this could be someone that slept their way to the top in a situation and they absolutely lied about what a uh, tarot reader or a channeler or a a medium or uh, a palm reader or whatever type of divination practice um, that spirit gifted someone they they went and paid for this work that spirit gifted someone and lied on what spirit gave to the to the gifted person to give to them that's problematic I don't know why someone would do that but it's problematic 
Um, usually when people lie about what they get in readings uh, or when they lie just in general, they probably don't have the clearest of intentions in a situation. Um, but um, so for some of you, you know, if somebody shared something with you. We have seen that letter K. So for some of you, maybe... Um, the letter K told you they had sex with someone they did not have sex with just to trigger you or make you feel some type of way uh, playing some weird game. For others of you, uh, someone could have, again, said that they, uh, something about Tiffany, um, something about a Tiffany box. Maybe someone did this to lie and, and get an engagement out of a situation. Oh, look at this guy with his little ponytail. I like his, he has like a little man, but it looks cute. And then he has his sides shaved. Everything is coming in for a reason. Something about King, something about King king the name king or king could be significant for some um but he has this little shide 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 shade shade um he has his little sides shaved and then his the middle is long and then he has a little bun up here it's really cute um everything is coming in for a reason um someone could have lied to try to get an engagement out of a situation damn that's just crazy i'm getting like someone lied and said that like this could be you or someone around you. Someone lied and said that you were supposed to be together. Like, that we're getting married. Because I'm getting the song, Picture Us Married. You and me. K-I-S-S-I-N-G. -S I remember the first time someone lied just to get you to fucking uh, marry them, my lovies. Or this was what you did. My this is fucking crazy. Some stuff be bananas, my lovies. Some stuff that be coming in, I just be like, something about Santa Anna. Oh my God. Something about Target in Santa Ana. My God, my God. Wow, some people are flawed, my lovies. That's crazy. Talk about energy manipulation. That's energetic warfare. That's black magic. I don't know why people don't think that's tragic. <laughs> Spirits are saying it's so tragic. Wow, holy cow. Look at me. I'm like, wow. It's like Home Alone. You know Home Alone, the movie, when he goes like this? Macaulay Culkin could be significant for some. Anyways, boom. Bye, good. Again, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Let's thank the ancestors, my lovies. I want to get started by honoring and thanking my grandmama. Go ahead, sister friend. My grandmama, Abuelita Gladys Nunez Maldonado, the warrior. Um, I'm getting that song. This is the song of a warrior. Uh, Alicia Keys and uh, Nas, warrior song. Your sister friend, um, you, you guys don't like to sing? For some of you, you don't, you don't like singing, my lovies, because I'm almost reserved to sing. I want to sing, but it's like some of you don't want to sing. Anyways, um... To my abuelita Gladys Nunez Maldonado, I also want to honor and thank my grandpapa, Abuelito Felix Antonio Nunez. I invite you to do the same. I do honor and thank your trusted ancestors, those that protect and love and guide you. I invite you to honor whatever religious force. People are fucking crazy, my lovies. Whatever spiritual force, whatever makes you feel good, grounded, and connected to the all as you are in this experience. You can also take a moment of silence to be in silence with yourselves. And that's also more than enough. Let's get started. You're going to lie and say that spirit sent a messenger because these are messengers of spirit a good messenger of spirit a good prophesizer a good channeler knows they are a messenger of spirit you're going to say that spirit told you through a messenger a vessel made for spirit to do this work you're going to be a jerk and say that someone lied and told you i mean someone told you that that you're supposed to get married with somebody and you know you fucking lied This is the song. This is what's coming in, my lovies. Of a warrior. Dang, my sister friends and my brother friends. Some shit be bananas. B A N N N. Yes, this shit is bananas. <laughs> So for Christine, that's actually in a real marriage <laughs> that was ordained by spirit. Um, there's a Christine. So the way in the dream, um, I was actually seeing someone that creates, for some of you, you're content creators. For some of you, you're really, again, you have a lot of notoriety. For some of you, you have a beautiful spirit. For some of you, um, all of you, you have a beautiful spirit, my lovies. But um, for some of you, you you reach a few more people. You you have a, a following. You have some type of, not even, I, I always feel weird saying following, but you have people that subscribe to to you and you are a channeler in your own way for a lot of people you share comedy you share content you share
share art, you share music, you share paintings, you share uh, a violinist came in for some of you, uh, an orthodontist wants to jump in, you share things about teeth, you share whatever it is you need to do. You share vehicle stuff, you share construction things, you share real estate things, you share things about uh, I don't know, civil engineering is coming in. Whatever it is that you stand for in your life, you mark people. You share that with people. And um, so for some of you, you have that energy, you know, that, that expresses itself. That That's like... You have you have a a mission and you share you you're you're like an evangelist for for spirit in one way or another. Um, for some of you, uh, Apple evangelists are coming in. Apple could be significant. This Apple energies has been very present for some of you. The last couple of days, I've noticed that wave. So it's like people love that energy. A Mercedes, a Mercedes truck. I'm I'm seeing a white Mercedes truck go, go by. It went by. It's gone by. A, a little a little convertible for some of you a little bmw convertible what are they like the, the 325 z's or something like that red bull for some of you this is a song of a warrior my lovies you are warriors Eleven thirteen, justice and death energy. A Libra, a Scorpio, November, September, October. Some type of legal procedure, a medical procedure, a death you could be learning. This death energy has been very present for some of you. You could someone speaks with a lisp. Um, you could be learning of a death of somebody for some of you. There's death in the field for you. There's death of a young lady for some of you. This is a song. Something about Utah. Something about a Tahoe. A Tesla. This is a song of a warrior. A Tesla truck. A warrior song. Mm -hmm. Brave-hearted and strong. Definition of a warrior. A white bald man. So back to Christine. So Christine, um, in the dream, and this can speak to a few of you in, in your own way, but um, in the dream, Christine um, has been married for a while and she has two children. And for some of you, you have a child. Um, and the way that it came in, it's like having an intervention of some sort in a marriage. For some of you, you can be going through some type of marriage counseling. Or if it's not marriage counseling, you're 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 allowing spirit to guide a, a union for you. A union could be significant. Someone's part of a workers' union. And uh, something about a chef is coming in as well for some of you. Something about a Chevy. Something about a Chevy Malibu. But um, this person is going through it. She's trying to figure out um, the first time, this is not the first time this energy's visited me in spirit. Um, the first time this energy visited me, I'm like, this person doesn't want to be married to this person. This person almost, it's like they're forcing a, a, a connection or faking like they're happy. So now this person, again, this was a few months ago that this energy first visited me. Now this energy came back, but now they're more frank they're still, they want time. The way that this person is presenting it is, I want to go stay with my mom so I can learn how to be a better wife. Um, I know there's things that I have not done correctly. There's also a, a weird conundrum happening energetically between this person and her husband's brother. In spirit, 
it's a little bit more transparent but this husband's brother tries to hide that maybe he has a crush for some of you this energy's been present someone wanted to marry either their stepsister or they wanted to or they're secretly lusting after their sister-in-law so take it how it resonates um this brother fights a lot with his brother and brings up a lot of his past like the way that it was coming in was energetically so this is happening on an energetic level however this is manifesting in the 3d as this little five of wands energy conflict in this family um you know however that resonates for you um and and to how whoever this applies to but um it's like this brother lies to you for some of you this is you watching this um or this could be for your partner this brother is very um just conniving it's coming in as very deceitful energy and and lustful energy but very secretively like trying to portray themselves as if they have like really good intentions for the couple for some of you we have seen that discerning between like really good matchmakers and really good witnesses to your marriage and people that are not that well-meaning um this brother was not that well-meaning even though surface level, it looks like he's even defending his sister-in-law, saying, you know, bro, you've messed up in the past. You used to cheat. You used to do this. You used to do that. Or maybe not cheat, but you used to be like, you used to stress her out. You were really immature, blah, 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 blah. Like bringing up stuff that has nothing to do with what's happening in the moment. Like he's talking about things like when these people first started and these people are well into their marriage and it's not even the same anymore um this female wants to go stay with her mama to just um i think to justify something i, I think this person needs to uh, they need time they need time if this is for you my lovies um the way it's coming in it's energetically this person knows that this was only gonna last so long but they really did try to make it they tried to fake it. They tried to fake this union. That's how the spirits are saying it. And um, now she's done. She's like, but but she's not saying I'm done because I I knew this was never going to go anywhere. I, I knew this was just a momentary thing. I knew that we were going to get X amount of years out of that. And that was it. Um, this person is making it seem as if she's going to go back to her mother, spend time with her mom, maybe relearn. It also, she does also want to be nurtured from her mother. This woman's looking for like a sacred womb of sorts. Maybe this person wants to start something. Here we go with this escort energy. Maybe this person wants an escort service. Uh, maybe this person wants to start a new life. Maybe this person wants to be nurtured by her mom. Maybe this person wants to nurture a project and needs a lot of feminine uh, energy around her. Um, because this person could be around a lot of masculine energy. Because again, for some of you, this, this person came in as having two sons. Or for some of you, have one son. Or for some of you, just a lot of, uh, 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 a lottery. For some of you, a lottery winner is involved in a situation. And a Sunday, a Sunday, a Sunday sinner not a Saturday sinner, a Sunday sinner. Boom. Anyways, uh, so this person's going through shifts in her life and she's trying to detach from her husband or like say, I want to go and spend some time with my mom just to kind of get away, just to have a reset in my mind, maybe to be a better wife. But there is a little bit of manipulation in this situation. I have to say it, my lovies. For some of you, um, again, this could be you in this energy. This could be someone around you, this energy. This could be your partner that you're dealing with. Someone knows that they want to kind of like you see i'm even like trying to pat it someone knows they want to break up with their husband but they don't want to say i want to break up with my husband and something about this energy of desmond has been very present for some of you take what resonates and leave what doesn't this is the song of a warrior and someone's kind of simpy to their wife so Succubus Incubus energy is also coming in for some. This is the song. A Mercedes, a silver Mercedes. Mm -hmm. Brave hearted. And... Gotta be brave hearted and strong, my love. He's a definition of a spiritual warrior. Oniva, to the all, to the all, to the all, to your unconditional love and your mercy, to your divine wisdom, to your all knowing, to your all being, to your all seeing power. What are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages? Something about Hialeah. To the all, to your unconditional love and your mercy, to your divine wisdom, to your all knowing, to your all being, to your all seeing power. What are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages? To the all, to your unconditional love and your mercy, to your divine wisdom, to your all knowing, to your all being, to your all seeing power. What are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages? To mi abuelita Gladys Nunez Malonado. 
se mi abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado, se mi abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado, se mi abuelito Félix Antonio Núñez, se mi abuelito Félix Antonio Núñez, se mi abuelito Félix Antonio Núñez. I'm justifying things in my mind. So someone's trying to justify things like, I want to, so for example, I'm thinking of spirits giving it to us in this way, but however this is applying to somebody, this is gonna, you know, help elucidate it in a way. Um, I'm thinking, when should we start the fa the fast? Something about the ferry, something about a ferry in New York. I'm like, when should we start the fast? And I'm like, well, I know that I have a vegan event coming up this Friday and there's gonna be some vegan food there that I may wanna eat. So I don't wanna like admit defeat and be tempted while I'm at the vegan fair. So let me push back the fast to next Wednesday so that I can start. So we'll have a five day fast from Wednesday to Sunday and then we'll have our, our collective read on Sunday but I'm like I'm trying to like move it around so I don't like cheat on my fast there's something there for some to my abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado to my abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado to my abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado to my abuelito Felix Antonio Núñez to my abuelito Felix Antonio you're taking the internet by storm my lovies for some of you you're taking the internet by storm you were warned that this would happen uh, to my abuelito Felix Antonio Nunez, to my abuelito Felix Antonio Nunez, to mama merci, to mama merci, to mama merci. So some of you, I'm seeing you on the red carpet, my lovies, or some type of red carpet is coming in. To Shango, to Shango, and drones, uh, to Shango, and Angelin, Angelina, so about Angelina Jolie, um, to Shane. Some of Seamus, to Yema, to Shane for some of you, uh, to Yemaya, <clears throat> to Yemaya, to Yemaya, to Papa Legpa, to Papa Legpa. The number 18, the number 19, the number 27. Uh, to Papa Legpa, to Papa Legpa, to Elegua, to Elegua, to Elegua, to Oshun, to Oshun, to Oshun, to Ogun, to Ogun, to Ogun, to La Santa Muerte. To la Santa Muerte, to la Santa Muerte, to Archangel Michael, to Archangel Michael, to Archangel Michael, to all of the trusted loving ancestors of all of those co-creating this work, what are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages, to all of the trusted loving ancestors of all of those co-creating this work and watching this work, what are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages, to all of the trusted loving ancestors of all of those that collaborate to create this work. What are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages in love and truth and courage and love and truth and wisdom and love and truth and honor and love and truth and justice and love and truth and courage and love and truth and wisdom and love and truth and honor and love and truth and judgment and love and truth and courage and love and truth and wisdom and love and truth and honor and love and truth and mercy. What is up? What is up? What is up? Hot stuff. How's it flowing? How's it going? What's popping? What's cracking? We're reading for my darlings. Reading for my darlings. Reading for my darlings. It is true. We're reading for you and we love you. My lovies is true. My lovies get two of my lovies. Let's do it, my lovies. Do it, my lovies. Get two of my lovies. Ooh, a BMW truck for some of you. Anyways, my lovies, fire off. A fire fuck that little that little child when his dad said, uh, um, say fire truck. Fire fuck fire fuck for some of you a fire truck could be significant as well what's up my lovies what is up what is up what is up everybody we are reading for uh gregorian may 15th 2024 energy so 15 energy in numerology is six energy so six energy does bring in hello it brings in a pause for some of you and it brings in an applause uh six energy in numerology so the devil energy is definitely present for some of you you could be dealing with a capricorn uh some type of temptation a toxic situation um a misstep in a situation shackled to addictions of all sorts um for some of you shackled to addictions of escorts anyways um but um and something about cora but um and something about corporate decorum uh and something about a hyundai and something about a subaru subaru and something about a honda pilot but um and something about a pilot but a, ph a, a philanthropist for some of you a pilot who's a philanthropist but um what's up my lovies um we're reading for you we're reading for the 15th which is six energy in numerology so six energy in numerology brings in a pause in a situation especially when it comes to the family the couple or the home the great thing about six energy is that you come back together at some point 
but you're not going to hold anybody up at gunpoint, my lovies. For some of you, you know how to love somebody. For some of you, you really love somebody, my lovies. For some of you, you're like, if we float together, that's great. If we grow together, that's great. Um, if it's our fate to be together, that's great too. Um, you're in flow. For some of you, you're open to a break. For some of you, if you need a break from a situation, you're open to it. Whether it be a connection, a relationship, a friendship, a marriage for some of you, a family situation, uh, family dramas have been present for some of you. You're not trying to force anything. You're like, if we grow together, we grow together. If we don't and you have to go your separate ways to live the life that is right for you, go ahead. Be happy. Peace, my hum peace my hummer for some of you peace your hummer peace to your hummer you think about your hummer for some of you um peace my honey um you ain't got no money for some of you someone has no money um but you're like peace my honey i would rather have no money and have peace in my life have peace with my wife for some of you you're you're breaking up for some of you could be breaking up with a side piece <laughs> <laughs> for some of you, you could be breaking up with somebody for some of you you're taking a pause though six energy brings in pauses and usually you reconvene six energy later on you're gonna come back and something about the shoulder lean for some of you you can be coming back for some of you you could be having some type of discussion with a group with uh with a, a i don't know a situation ship for some of you uh you're on and off on and off again with somebody you're gonna be off right now or you're about to be off and then later on you're gonna come back later on maybe for some of you in the autumn for some of you there could be a break in a situation until autumn maybe october um maybe you gone to november even for some of you someone could be gone for a while they're gonna be taking a break or a pause from a situation for a while for some of you it could just be a few days of a pause until nine energy so that you can decide whether you want an ending or not an ending of pretending but for some of you pauses in situations six energy also can bring in conflicts in work situation or in groups and we have seen that as well for some of you a little bit of conflict in the groups and work settings and things of that sort for some of you all types of energies moving around i had this beautiful conversation with someone and whoever is uh whoever is religious okay for some of you are religious whoever is religious for some um whoever is um into spiritual practices whoever has ever been to any type of spiritual um ceremony they use coffee coffee is very important in spiritual serum serum and a, a serum of some sort for some of you um something about cough syrup for some um coffee is very important in spiritual ceremonies and you can do your research on why but it definitely i like to simplify it and say it lifts the spirits and it gets the energies moving and when that happens you know it can shake up all types of energies right ogun energy can come in uh oshun energy can come in um the the orishas of of pathways the leg buzz can come in um and the different variations of that energy the sekmets can come in for those of you who are more into egyptian mythology and and, and cosmology um not mythology is really cosmology uh something about apollo the apollo energy comes in these these energies are to create paths but they tend to bring war um we interpret it as war in our lives especially if we have difficult times letting go of situations but for some of you there is war like shifts happening so you could feel a lot of tension in the air you could feel like things are not necessarily um i am getting for some of you you feel like something's not fair in a situation um you could be feeling the conflicts like the like it's like a rubbing of the energies um you may interpret it as like rubbing of personalities rubbing of like something's rubbing you the wrong way for some of you rubbing alcohols involved in a situation uh for some of you a nurse or some type of of medical emergency or going to the doctors for some of you, you need shots like i'm get i'm getting someone like getting shots or something like that like cleaning and then getting shots take that how it resonates for some of you vaccinations are getting a uh, blood drawn you need blood draw for some for some of you this drug testing has been very present as well um so all types of like conflict energy poking energy things of that sort look at that look at that you see you see the little muscle there right look gotta love it gotta love it my love he's gotta love yourself for some of you there could be tests there could be medical tests that have you a little bit in conflict um there could be a pause in a in a for some of you a restriction of some sort but um there's definitely like grinding energies um mechanical energies uh five of swords energy a little bit too so there could be envy uh we have seen that very envious energy in the field for some of you mean spirits uh people doing things just for the sake of saying they got away with something competitive energies um it's it's grindy energies but you're gonna take a pause from this situation to maybe have like a for some of you're gonna get a standing ovation you're gonna do a good job conflict management skills um maybe for some of you need to detach from a situation to reconvene so 
2911 energy all right so the tricksters tarot wanted to speak with you this one wanted to show itself but before we do that we're gonna go with the getting to know truth getting to know you my lovies so that um so that let's play we're gonna play and let's play a game for some of you for some of you uh, uh saw energies in the field the movie saw i'm seeing a little saw doll for some of you, you could be wearing a lot of makeup and you kind of look a little clownish my love <laughs> You're wearing, you're wearing, for some of you you're wearing a lot of makeup I love you. <laughs> you're cute <laughs> for some of you someone's a prostitute um what's the longest you've ever gone without taking a shower the shower energy i told you for some of you it's on and off it's been very present for some of you especially if you have little sons and you have a conflictual marriage uh Give them the shower. Give them the golden shower, my lovies. Um, it's not a perverted thing, my lovies. It's actually really old medicine. Look it up. For some of you, there's it comes in with your children or a child around you. Take it how it resonates. You know, it's up to you. For some of you, a child needs a haircut too or a child just got a haircut or they're about to. Anyways, there are a lot of lies in a situation, a lot of spying, a lot of lying. But there's a child that could use a, a golden shower for some of you. This energy has been very, very present. Um, but um, truth, Nunez, uh, the longest that I've gone without taking a shower when I was... Oh, spiritual retreat energy has been very present for you as well, my lovies. When I went to Ibando in Gabon and I went to my spiritual retreat uh, where I was with the plant medicine called Iboga um it was freaking intense i've been through a lot of initiations in my life my lovies uh by far that was the most rewarding yet fucking challenging um initiation and um it was it was uh it made me a worthy a worthy a worthy being i think um but um it was really sweet that spirit brought us to do that because it was intense um for some of you you may need a spiritual retreat to admit defeat to yourself and to spirit and allow spirit to like surrender to spirit um iboga is intense for anybody um who uh cares i'll show i'll, I'll share the link i'll share the link um i will put it in the description box and if the video uploads quick enough i'll put it in uh, the comments as well um so you can look at it because um it's really life-changing everything is coming in for a reason i did not shower for a few days when i was with a, i didn't eat for a few days i didn't shower i didn't want to eat at all it closed my stomach and it's like it's known to do that to people especially when you take a lot of of spoons of the plant medicine um your stomach it's like you don't even but you have to because you have to reintegrate and you don't want to stay in that like um spiritual uh state where things are um not necessarily coagulated um so it, it's really intense but whoever wants to look at that i want uh when i was there everything is coming in for a reason i was uh i was there for almost two weeks the second time around but it felt like I was there for a day. It, it felt like I was there for a day. It didn't even feel like two weeks. Um, but um, I got so many downloads. It was really intense. It was the most intense experience I've ever had in my life. Um, the most rewarding experience I've ever had in my life. But very, very challenging. Um, but I didn't shower for like four days. Four days while I was with the medicine. Um, just processing. I didn't eat. I, I, did, I barely left the room. After I, I was just like, I want to just be by myself processing everything I was processing. It was really really initiation by like fire it was intense it was intense it was intense but um what's the longest you've ever gone without taking a shower for some of you my lovies um they say for the plant medicine they say you die you have like a death of some sort and i definitely did i feel like um i died in a way um i it just um it's very difficult to explain um to people that haven't gone through it but for some of you i think spirit wants you to you know take it how it resonates there's something there for somebody if you were given a choice to choose your manner of death how would you die for some of you that ayahuasca retreat has been very present but for some of you iboga is a little bit stronger and by a little bit i mean incredibly stronger and uh, for example ayahuasca is like a night and then you know you kind of like come back down to earth uh, you ground back in the 3d um iboga easily if i hadn't eaten 
easily I could have been, you know, in 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 that spiritual state, in that other dimension. Um, easily, the whole two weeks. Easily, it would have been the whole two weeks. Um, so, you know, there's something there for somebody. Um, it brings a death. They say it brings a death. It brings, um, it brings a death. It's a huge, for some of you, you're going through an ego death. For some of you, I think you're going through an ego death. For some of you, I don't know if it's just the, the divorce itself or a separation or quitting a work or some of, someone's going through an ego death, my lovies, like a, a serious one. And these things can take years. <laughs> they can take years. For some people, they could take a fucking lifetime or a few. What's your biggest pet peeve? Today, what's my biggest pet peeve? It's too early to tell. It's too early to tell. Why is it coming in like that? It's too early to tell what I don't like about something. What's my biggest pet peeve today? I ate almonds earlier. Right before starting this video, I had a few almonds. And it's bothering me that they're around my teeth. That's my biggest pet peeve at this particular time. It could be something simple. Uh, for some of you, it's your pimples. My God, my loveys. I love your pimples. I love them all. I love them, Paul. Six of Swords, you're traveling. You're going. You're flowing. You're moving away from a storm. My hair is still a little wet. You saw that little drip? It went... Um, you're moving away from a storm. For some of you, you could be getting dry. Like, you know when cats don't like water? Um, some cats don't, and they get they don't like it. Um, but um, for some of you, um, you could be drying yourself. For some of you, Six of Swords energy is moving away from a storm. You could be traveling as well. These are long-distance travels. For some of you, you could be traveling for a spiritual retreat. For some of you, you want to retreat. Six of Swords, you want to move away from an internal or an external storm. For some of you, you could be going somewhere to stay temporarily with someone that is going to be supportive of you. But the Six of Swords, they're telling me, comes right. 1967 could be significant for some. Someone's going to be sent from heaven. 1963 is also coming in. 1965, the 60s are very present. Um, but um, And someone's very pregnant. For some of you, someone could be going to stay with someone because they're pregnant. Um, for some of you, Six of Swords energy is very close to what they're saying is the Seven of Swords. So there's a little bit of deceit or trying to get away with something in a situation. For some of you, someone could be manipulating timelines. Again, everything came in earlier for a reason. If I do this here, then I'm not in trouble per se because it looks like I'm doing, you know... I'm I can indulge here and not get in trouble per se that has something to do with something like that for some of you someone wants to indulge and not get in trouble because of the timing <laughs> timing is important in a situation six of swords energy spirits inviting for some to move away from a storm to find internal external peace for some of you you could be retreating from a situation six energy we're right in it and Six of Swords energy, you move away from conflicts. You, you're you like, I'm leaving this storm behind. I want to, I've already weathered the storm. I've been in the storm. So you move away from a Five of Swords and you go to a Six of Swords. But you're right in between the deceit and the, so the, the storm has not cleared in a situation. This is really interesting. For some of you, the storm has not cleared, but people are trying to move away. They're trying to find their peace. They're saying a gold Mercedes for some can be significant. A lot of Mercedes energy. Someone's trying to find their peace. They're trying to... Uh, move away from a situation karma was present as well for some of you carlos will be present in a situation for some of you jose for some of you joshua for some of you joshua tree uh, for some of you big bear is coming in um for some of you lake for some of you being by the lake somewhere for some of you silver lake is coming in for some of you uh uh clear lake for some of you there's some place in new hampshire that they have like really beautiful lakes near the mountains for some of you the mountains could be significant for some of you the santa monica mountains are coming in as well we have moving away from a storm for some of you turkey is coming in we have moving away from a storm we have moving away from some of you you could also um there's something about a tesla and having to do something with a tesla uh, mechanic with a tesla or getting your tesla checked out for some of you insurance for some of you insurance fraud something about at&t something about an atm something about a range rover ace of cups for self-love for a baby for innocence for uh feeling fulfilled in life moving away from a situation for some of you you could be getting someone Six of Swords, Six of Swords. For some of you, you could be getting someone pregnant. <laughs> six of Swords, Six of Swords. Moving away. Six of Swords, Six of Swords. A lot of travel, a round trip. 
a round trip travel somewhere. For some of you, you could be traveling for love. Gemini energy is coming in. Uh, really excited. <laughs> a Gemini energy is coming in. We got Gemini, Aquarius, Libra energy, uh, air signs. But the Six of Swords is um, by far one of the air signs with the most amount of emotion in it. Because now, and this Six of Swords, unlike other Sixes of Swords, look at, look at how calm the waters are. Look at how beautiful. Even they could they could even do this in a little box. For some of you, you can move something in a little box. You don't have to have such big shipments for something. For some of you, you could be moving and you're trying to like minimize. For some of you, you could be taking something somewhere and it's like just put it in a small box. Let's not let's not make it so clunky. This whole energy of not wanting to travel with too many clunky things, or if you have to travel with things, you have to bring something somewhere. For some of you, your breasts really hurt. My breasts feel really sore. For some of you, you could be traveling with a mama or some. Someone who's like in an early stages of pregnancy, um, you know, like when you get like the morning sickness, the, the really, really, really sore boobs, um, even though they don't really go away, you know, through the pregnancy, but in the beginning is super uncomfortable. For some of you, someone's in an early stage of a pregnancy and they could be getting out of this early. Maybe someone's moving into their sixth month for some of you of pregnancy and they're going to be like much more like uh, smoother sailing when it comes to a situation. Something about epic failing when it comes to a situation. Smoother sailing, they're not going to be as irritable when it comes to a situation or they're not going to be as triggered they have now settled into the pregnancy as the babies are coming in for some of you again you have two children because look at these little two children in the box for some of you two children for some of you, you could be taking your children somewhere you can be getting away with a child or with your children for some of you for some of you you have a few children for some of you the majority it's like two or one child uh for some of you you have a pet for some of you you may the veterinarian energy was also present for some of you for some of you you need to uh, schedule something with your vet maybe for june for some because maybe your bet your bet for some of you you got to make a bet as well anyways six of swords energy for some of you you could be traveling for love you could be traveling for new love for some of you you could be traveling for a new relationship for some of you you could be traveling for something that is emotional and it's new to you a lot of six of swords energy twice shooty pootsy spirits advising move away from the storm for some for some of you, you have to travel to set the record straight in a situation and then travel back to a situation. For some of you, you do have an on again, off again relationship that's like, it hasn't really like, it's not cemented yet, but there's emotion there or there's like, for some of you, you could be seeing an opportunity in a situation. Fidelity investment. For some of you, investing energy has been very present. For some of you, there could be a, a high stakes something, but you're seeing an emotional, you have a huge investment emotionally in this. This is important to you for some reason. In your soul, emotionally, this is really like, opening you up to something for some of you you could be traveling for self-love you could be traveling for some type of spiritual retreat by the summertime for some of you in june for some of you something about juniper something about grand junction something about jumanji robin williams robin hood Strength energy, Leo energy, uh, having the strength to go through a process. For some of you, you could have the strength to, to go through some type of difficult initiation. For some of you, I am feeling the dark night of the soul. Six of swords, six of swords. It's like, uh, but if you're in the six of swords and you're not moving forward, that means you're stuck in a storm. But for some of you, you are moving quite swiftly through an initiation. For some of you, you're going through some type of initiation to build up your strength. By August, for some of you, August is going to be very significant as well for you leo season late july into early august or mid august for some of you uh august 15th is coming in july 23rd is also coming in july 27th july 25th um we have leo energy here we have strength the strength to do something um for some of you are trying to be reserved for some of you are trying to tackle an alligator for some of you are trying to tackle a hater for some of you are trying to um dismantle a situation for some of you anyways i like it that was really sweet i really liked it for some of you a cat you have a cat for some for some of you, you actually have a black cat or someone around you has a black cat for some of you you like to dress in black like emo energy the hierophant for some of you you're definitely going to a spiritual retreat or you're going to see some type of shaman or you're going to see some type of witch doctor <laughs> like you are for some of you, you could be coming here i'm, I'm technically a witch doctor my love is a lovey one. A lovey-dovey one. Who loves everybody. Um, 
and wants well for everybody, my love. He's a hierophant. For some of you, spiritual beliefs. For some of you, a belief system. For some of you, some type of initiation. It is in your field. For some of you, celebration. You're celebrating. You're celebrating for some of you. Celebrate good times. Come on. A Taurus could be significant for some of you. Um, all right, bomba ekut. Bomba ekut, my love. He's 44-16. Um, hmm. 44 and 16, huh? <laughs> For some of you, uh, seven energy is there though with that 16 energy travel, cancer energy travels long distance travels for some of you the next months or the next few months are going to bring you a lot of travel distance travels for spiritual stuff uh for some of you could be traveling for a wedding as well for some of you for some of you it could be traveling uh vetting vetting something or someone you're going to vet something or someone two 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 oh look two 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 <laughs> two 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 is over here. Must die rich. Must die rich. There's a sticker. Must die rich. Um, one nine seven three two and nine. Utah. Utah's present. 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 Someone's pregnant. 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 A CPA. Uh, we got a king of hearts and a face-to-face -face with a well-meaning man. For some of you over your uh, Mercury Day, which rules the written, you have uh, news from a well-meaning man, written documents from a well-meaning man. Your father can get some news. For some of you, you are being protected by a loving ancestor, masculine energy. For some of you, you can have a face-to-face -face well well Wellington. Something, and here we go with this beef Wellington. You can have a face to face with a well meaning man around you. This could be your father. This could be a friend. This could be a well meaning man that really loves you. The King of Hearts normally brings in someone that is plus age. For some of you, someone is older than you. This could be someone who is older than you, um, significantly older than you. This could be a father. This could be a well meaning man around you. You have face to face with this person. You have news from this person. You have a letter from this person, an email from this person, communication from a well meaning man. For some of you, this could also be a well meaning, um, for some of you, you could be talking to a spirit spiritual leader or some time uh, some time it's been for some time now you you could be talking to a spiritual coach a spiritual leader a shaman of some sort uh a hierophant you could be talking to someone that's very important in some type of organization or or is a thought leader in an organization for some of you for some of you you could be in this situation because i'm also feeling for some of you this is you and this energy as a thought leader of whatever you know beliefs whatever processes you bring to this world um you are well-meaning and you have communication with well-meaning people in in a work situation for some of you really really good news for some of you for some of you you just got a letter this letter important letter or priority mail for some of you has been in the field for some of you your priority mail was an epic fail you didn't get the priority mail or the the ricardo um the priority mail didn't get delivered for some of you there have been delays in the priority mail something got uh, delayed by a young brunette or paperwork got delayed or a secretary delayed priority mail or someone at a host stand or someone in administration or a triage or some type of host or some type of finance admin eight of clubs energy is a young brunette or someone who works in administration or someone that works with paperwork there are delays in paperwork or delivering paperwork again for some of you i am getting priority mail but it got it again it was an epic fail spirit gave it to us for a reason it didn't get delayed for some of you, a young brunette could have not delivered something. I am seeing a male woman, but take that how it resonates. Someone or someone messed up when it come, came to mailing something on time. It's a bit about Kim. Insurance claims for some of you. A little bit of money too. For some of you, you could be paying new insurances or you could be renewing insurances. Or for some of you, you're signing up for new insurance for some of you. I'm getting like insurance documents as well for some. That could be significant. It's in your field. I really, 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 I love them, my lovies. <laughs> I love them, my lovies. Your spirit friends love you, my lovies. A, a white BMW, a Nissan Sentra, something about Concentra. You definitely have drug testing in the field. Um, you got success when it comes to this drug test. You have success when it comes to any blood work. For some of you, uh, testing for hormones too. You know what I'm getting? I'm getting... Okay, lies in a situation. You know what I'm getting when people... For some of you, someone could have lied and so you have to get a drug test for something? <laughs> what? They spied on you, they lied on you. That's what the spirits are saying. They spied on you, they lied on you. You may need to get drug tests for something, my lovies. 
you're going to be fine. You're going to pass. Uh, but for some of you, I am getting like testing for steroids. For some of you, testing for steroids in a situation as well. Something's really weird. There are some people that are nuts. 4911. The 49ers? A designer? For some of you, someone could be accused of doping. Something about dopamine is coming in. For some of you, melatonin is in your field as well. You could be taking supplements. For some of you, somebody could have seen you taking supplements. So there's Fer Ferguson. Ferguson. There are famous people that um, Lexus. Um, Alexis, there are certain people that need to be very, very cautious of who they call their friends. Spirit sometimes prepares you in ways where it's like not everyone can sit at your table when you reach a certain level of notoriety. You have to really protect yourself spiritually, physically, emotionally, because people, certain people, certain demons exist in this world and they cloak themselves in best friends and people that want to party with you and people that want to something about Bacardi um, and people that want to submit about cardi b um and people that want to pretend like they are your friend like they have your best interest in mind they have this great business idea um spirit has to like thicken your ego in a certain way like you have to break the ego but you also have to have a good padding to know when to use the ego for some of you uh something about lego my ego for some of you um someone's gonna falsely accuse you of like doping as like a a, a an artist okay for some of you an artist um as a as an athlete that's what's coming in and you may have to get like testing or for some of you this may just be some about genetic testing as well for some of you this may just be part of your like your natural flow um it's just part of your work you may need to get tested because there are false ac accusations all the time so they're all someone's guilty because I'm seeing the word guilty in my mind's eye anyways you got success when it comes to a situation for some of you a defamation suit may be needed nay Nay, N A Y, or N E Y, something about Neymar. Ace of Clubs, you have success no matter what you're doing. If you're getting tested, if you need to get tested for drug testing, if you need to uh, get tested for hormones, if you need to get tested for testosterone levels, if you need to get tested for steroids for some of you, uh, you have success. You have positive news. Uh, for some of you, a defamation suit may be needed because uh, some psychopaths may have tried to accuse you of some bullshit that was not true. So I would. I would. I totally would. I would. Even just for the sake of the principle alone. Just for that alone alone um i would i would my lovies especially if it's taking time effort and energy for you to clear your name in a situation i would but for some of you it may not be something that serious for some of you it may just be you need regular testing because you are a division we've seen that division one athlete of something or a high performance athlete of something and you may need to just get tested because it's part of what you need to do um that's how it's feeling for some of you for some of you money you got success when it comes to a lot of money for some of you things have to do with a lot of money big contracts when it comes to a significant amount of money for some of you, again, for some of you, Sports Illustrated is in your field. Uh, a model, for some of you, a front page model. For some of you, Jesus. For some of you, there's a lie in a situation, though, and there's a spy in a situation. Anyways, you got money. You got contracts tied, tied to a lot of money. Uh, for some of you, uh, something about Trayvon Martin. Something about Four Locos. Um... You have money. For some of you, it could be in activism. For some of you, it could be in, in, in something about prosperity and racial rights. Anyways, this whole reparations energy has been in and out the last few days. So for some of you, reparations could be significant or you talk about reparations. For some of you, it could be some type of activist. Anyways, you got a lot of money coming in for some of you. And this gold Mercedes wants to show up. Eight of spades energy, worries, people that um, are worried, stressed. For some of you, uh, health issues or health concerns or stresses. Eight of spades energy is psychological or physical states of disease being out of ease. You could be worried about a significant amount of money. For some of you, you will receive communication that's going to worry you when it comes to a significant amount of money. For some of you, a lot of text messaging over these next 24 hours. You've been in a lot of communicative spirits. For some of you, you're calling a lot, you're texting a lot, you're emailing a lot, you're Microsoft teaming a lot, you're instant messaging a lot, you're WhatsApping a lot, you're FaceTiming a lot. For some of you, you have a lot of conversations with a lot of people about a lot of money, a lot of deals. A lot of things happening. For some of you, you're really busy. You're really, 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 really busy. And you're worried about blocks. Or you're worried about communication that is blocked. Or you're worried about money that is blocked. Bon. 
But you have this communication to come. For some of you, if something is blocked, another door opens. For some of you, there's something that is blocked. There's an avenue that you are exploring that is currently blocked. And by when the block comes out, when the nine of spades comes out, spirit wants you, we buy cars. For some of you, you could be a car salesman. This car salesman energy has also been in and out. For some of you, there could be an avenue that is blocked when it comes to a business deal. You could be selling some vehicles. For some of you, I am getting like, there was an energy present yesterday that came in of um, closing a big business deal. But for some of you, this big business deal may fall to shit. It may just go to shit. For some of you, you work as commission sales um, and any Anyone that's ever worked in commission sales uh especially when you're selling like big deals um you know that sometimes these deals can take a long time for some of you it's like if you close a a, a deal that has to do with you know it's like a hundred thousand, two hundred thousand. For some of you, you sell some, you sell, you sell really important things. Um, you know, millions of dollars of in a deal. Uh, you, something is blocked. For some of you, something can have to do with seven hundred thousand dollars. For some of you, seventy thousand dollars. For some of you, the number seven is important. For some of you, this eighty thousand has been present as well. Um, take what resonates. And for some of you, three hundred thousand was also present the other day. It actually came in as two hundred and ninety-seven. Um, or something's gonna be lowered by twenty thousand, almost two hundred and seventy-nine. Anyways, for some of you, um, you're really wheelie, wheelie, wheelie is involved in a situation. And something about wheelie, like a last name of some sort, and then Papa Wheelie. For some of you, a mongoose. For some of you, you could be a BMX is coming in as well. For some of you, you have a big deal that's gonna or a brand deal that's gonna fall. That's gonna fall. It's gonna be blocked. But in the autumn, for some of you, by autumn, because I'm getting it like fall as in by autumn for some of you you have communication when it comes to another deal my lovey something else is going to come in even though for some of you you may be very disappointed because a deal that you really wanted is uh you're anointed spirit saying so don't you worry about it spirit ain't playing about you my loveys you have communication when it comes to something else you have another deal coming in for some of you for some of you there's going to be a messenger that's going to stress you out or for some of you, someone wants to stress you out with a message. For some of you, there's a messenger who's also very worried about communicating a deal with you or about communicating. They want to steal. This is going to be a steal. I'm seeing robbery in my mind's eye in the uh, Pantha Oracle. But I am getting it like someone wants to really like breadcrumb you and use your energetic resources they're thinking it's a steal a kia could be significant for some something about ikea i'm getting tag swapping like for some of you uh just being cautious if you actually do steal something because i'm getting like tag swapping like someone's gonna try to tag swap like like um ikea is coming in but take that how it resonates it's like like saying like oh this is this i saw this skew uh for x amount of money but it's like that's not the price that's not even the tag for that thing again take what resonates with what doesn't that's what's coming in for some of you anyways you got a messenger or someone that's going to communicate something but they're going to be very nervous for some of you this could be a young person for some of you i am seeing a young lady in my mind's eye for some of you someone in administration or a secretary could be very worried about communicating something for some of you someone's worried because they want to breadcrumb you or shortchange you in some way um so just keep that in mind in this present moment or very very quickly after you visualizing this video the ten of spades is in this present moment or something coming in like you watch this video and then like maybe like right away right after or right as you're watching this something happens when it comes to this scary ass messenger for some of you and for some of you something about messier yeah. uh french for some of you for some of you uh you can be getting news from someone in france something about okay something about toulouse something about tulum something about monaco Something about a monastery. Something about a missionary. Something about Sudan, Africa. A Sudanese. I'm seeing like a bunch of children in Sudan. 58, 12. 50 and 12. 13 energy, hierophant. Strength energy, 13 energy, death energy. Strength, hierophant, Leo, Scorpio, Taurus. Libra, 28, high priestess, strength, secrets, help holding back, needing to be strong when it comes to something spiritually that's taking place. Anyways, in this present moment, Nissan Rogue, 
we got changes, 10 of diamonds. You have to travel an hour or so away from where you are. For some of you, uh, big changes. For some of you, movement. For some of you, you have to move something. Again, we did say you have to move something out of distance. For some of you, you yourself could be moving. Uh, for some of you in this present moment, you're focused on a move. You're focused on changes. Um, you're focused on big changes for some of you. For some of you, you could be focused on big travels as well. King of diamonds energy. For some of you, certainly, certainly, Emily. We have a queen of diamonds. We have a female who doesn't have your best interest in mind in a situation, um, who's blocking a situation for some of you. Uh, we have a king of hearts. For some of you, we have a not-so-well-meaning female around your father, around your significant other, around a well-meaning man. We have a queen of diamonds. For some of you, this could be a friend who has a female with them. For some of you, this energy has been present. For some of you, of someone whose spouse does not like you. They don't want you in their house. They don't want you near them because this person's a liar and a deceiver and they know that you can liberate this person for some of you this could be a brother this could be a friend this could be a son this could be a loved one this could be someone that really cares about you and you care about them but the the queen of diamonds or you know male female take it how it resonates they have somebody around them that they don't want you, they this person's spouse does not want you with them because they don't want you to tell the truth they don't like the truth this queen of diamonds does not like the truth usually the queen of diamonds in a private read is a female a female who does not have your best interest in mind in a situation for some of you there is a gentleman uh, who uh, has a female around this could be a friend for some of you if this is a work situation there's a man who really really likes you and then a female who's kind of like trying to be buddy buddy with him knowing that she doesn't give a shit about him or you but she's doing it to spite you for some of you someone that's the energy for some of you someone's trying to do something to spite you they're trying to get close to your buddy to spite you for some reason this is how this person thinks she needs to see a shrink. This person is angry. There's anger. It feels angry. Seven of diamonds energy. Anger. When it comes to this person, for some of you, this could be a family member. Ace of hearts energy. We have the family, the home, the couple. Uh, for some of you, uh, your dad's wife. Or your dad's ex-wife, for some of you, does not like you or does not like the family. For some of you, issues in the family have been very present. Anger when it comes to the home. Anger when it comes to the couple. Anger when it comes to the family. For some of you, the family you have you have been born into. For some of you, your family's trying to block you. For some of you, there is a family um, who has sided with a female who doesn't have their best interest in mind or your best interest in mind. You got joy. They're pissed because you're happy. This energy is the theme. It's been the fucking theme the last few days, my lovies. Uh, people that you haven't talked to, they want to give you grace. They have grace. Something about grace anatomy. Um, they want to be relevant in your life. Uh, people that turn their back on you to betray you for a conniving demon who just came in, someone that they just barely know. Again, for some of you, you have family members who turn their back on you for a female. And they're, they're siding with this female who doesn't have your best interest in mind. For some of you, this could be your father's ex again. Or for some of you, a stepmom is involved in a situation. For some of you, a stepdad is also involved in a situation. Everything's going to be fine. For some of you, you're not in drama. You, you're not. You're not in drama. You're literally not in drama. They want to act like you're also in the drama because they want to trigger you to be in drama with them. You have nothing to say. For some of you, this energy has been very present. You have nothing to say. You are happy as a little kite. <laughs> For some of you, you can sleep at night. For some of you, you're like a little hummingbird. 010211. 01211. That's 222 energy. For some of you, uh, you're it's like you're in very divine feminine energy. For some of you, you are male or female. You're in very mystic energy. For some of you, you are working on yourself. You're working on your system if everybody else is having a system meltdown you can't go down with them wish them the best of luck goodbye you're you're okay you're not gonna die over anybody else people losing their minds out here losing their minds for some of you, you have a group of family members a group of women in your family who are just losing their mind out here for some of you your mom your mom Jamal, Mal, Molly. Hi, I've been looking for Molly. I've been searching everywhere and I can't seem to find Molly. Molly, Molly, Molly. For some of you, uh, these people like Molly. For some of you, these could be people that pretend to be your family. For some of you, these are people that come to your house and don't have your best interest in mind. I don't understand people that like random people in their house. I don't like a lot of people in my house. Not even people that I've known for forever. Since I was a little girl, I got used to being, again, for, for me, isolation is like heaven. It's like me and my little cocoon. That's how I am. That's how I am. That's always how I've been. I'm more social sometimes than others. I am a very introverted extrovert, my lovies. I am a very introverted. Again, this work, 
this was spirit that told me you have to do this work <laughs> and you have to listen to our instructions. But for me, I'm a very introverted extrovert. I love to talk to people. I love to feel people because I feel people very deeply, but I also love my solitude. I really do, my lovies. I really, really do. The only exception to that rule is if I am in a relationship and because I have such an intense connection with the person. If I'm having sex with you, if I am eating with you, sleeping with you, kissing you, um, being being on you it's like my connection to you again I've shared this before uh the last guy that I dated we would test it because he's like this power is is amazing he kind of it's kind of scared him a little bit he's like you read all of my thoughts like that's a little too much for me sometimes I read all of it I would read all of his thoughts and I would just say it and he's like you know that I was you know I was thinking that like he started to notice it like he noticed it from the beginning his family has powers too uh they come from they they uh, came from Guanajuato um in Mexico and that area is known to have mummies and they're no dummies they're no dummies I met his family and uh one of his cousins he said it's really good to see you again in this life um because he's seen me before I had visions of I'm like we've done this before we've met in other lives but this time it's a little different um everything is coming in for a reason um they're magical beings on this planet my love he's all types of them people with all types of powers i've met shapeshifters vampires uh people that can travel through time there are all types of beings on this planet my lovies all types of beings um you got to get out of the, the 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 matrix living a little bit to, to see it but for some of you you know this you know this my lovies um but yeah, so for me, it's like, I, I, I just can't have random people around me or random people in my house, especially. For some of you, you have a lot of people all over your, your place. It's like, for some of you, you're going to block these people out. Or for some of you, there's a well-meaning man around you who's been hanging around a lot with a bunch of females who don't have his best interests in mind. This person is going to change. This person wants to detach himself from these people. And these people are fucking pissed. But this is a blessing. This is really a blessing. No stressing. This is a blessing. All right, we have three seven. So bodily aches and pains. For some of you, be cautious, my lovies, um, with any issues, any, again, insurance for some of you. For some of you, you may need to get something done with a physical or something because we have issues, money here. For some of you, you may get into a little bit or someone around you may get into a little bit of a boo-boo or something and someone doesn't have insurance and they have to pay quite a bit of money to get something fixed. For some of you, we do have three sevens. For some of you, you have to get a pet fixed. I'm getting like getting a pet fixed and you have to spend a lot of money and that worries you. We have three sevens and an eight of spades so that means that physically things you know be cautious banging your you know your your elbow too hard on something uh someone falling an elderly falling or you even for some of you you know uh driving and and being a little reckless especially with these anger energy just being cautious for some of you um just being cautious my lovies what else? We have 310. So satisfaction when it comes to a project that you're working on that's going to make you very happy. For some of you, if you are worried, there's nothing to worry about when it comes to a house situation. For some of you, you could be living somewhere where you don't necessarily want to stay or temporary um, housing somewhere where you don't necessarily want to stay. Everything is going to be all right. We do have two nines, so a significant amount of money, communication when it comes to a significant amount of money from a well-meaning gentleman, but also anger when it comes to a significant amount of money for some of you in this present moment. But there's a well-meaning gentleman who's going to help you fix an issue when it comes to a significant amount of money. If you have any issues when it comes to um, depositing funds or transferring funds, there's a well-meaning man who's going to communicate with you and he's going to worry about a situation when it comes to a significant amount of money for some of you. There could be an issue when it comes to a significant amount amount of money because there are females that don't necessarily have your best interest in mind who are messing around with your money for some of you or trying to for some of you this could be family members lying to you anyways we got a uh, seven of diamonds a little bit of clarity here it's a well-meaning man for some of you it's you for some of you it's a well-meaning man around you who's angry when it comes to projects or when it comes to things that they have to work on this person a, tw a, tes a twab and tesla or a subway for some of you, we have eight of spades. We have uh, an ex as well who wants to show up. For some of you, someone in a work situation as well wants to show up. For some of you, have an ex who's worried about a situation. For some of you, you can have an ex who's worried about his work. For some of you, you as a gentleman could be worried about your work. For some of you, you as a gentleman could be worried about a significant amount of money. 
that's blocked by a work situation for some of you you could be worried about uh having to pay a deposit on a new place for some of you certainly this female who's not um not very well meaning to you is communicating with you you're talking a lot this is for you as a gentleman for some of you you're having a lot of conversations with an ex or a female who doesn't have your best interest in mind for some of you this person could stay with you for some of you you could be in a, an on again off again situation with a female who doesn't have your best interest in mind and you're talking to this this Ferguson you're talking to this person quite a bit this person also talks a lot to her father about a situation for some of you boom for some of you, uh, this female pretends to be a well-meaning female. She's not. For some of you, this energy of this young brunette who pretends to be a well-meaning female in your life, but she's not, has been very present. For some of you, eventually, you're going to block this female out who is uh, a young brunette around you who pretends to be your friend, but this person's just drama-filled. Again, we have seen that for some of you, people that are willing to uh, tarnish your soul by dragging you into drama, they're not your friend. I don't care how innocent they look. is bullshit. Uh, Queen of Hearts energy to the Eight of Clubs. You have a, a couple of... Of young brunettes for some of you uh, that you're going to block out or for some of you have people that work in administration that you're going to block out or for some of you have uh, people I don't know you have at least three females here for some of you who don't have your best interest in mind these could be people that are in your family for some of you this could be a sister this could be cousins for some of you this could be people that you know don't have your best interest in mind a group of females for some of you again someone could work as an uh, an mn what's an mn m and n m n is coming in uh something about m and m is coming in um slim shady these people are shady and they're angry because you're not going to talk to them or you don't want to. Oh, one, oh, one, ten, oh, nine. Yeah, because you're going to distance yourself really far from these people. And they're, pa and they're patty and they're pissed. Patty could be pissed all she wants. No offense, patty, my lovey, go find your fucking peace. You and your niece. For some of you, someone's niece is involved in a situation too. Messy, messy people. Messy, messy people. And they take that as an insult. It's like, no, my love, go find your peace. It's like, go find your peace. That's it. That's it. For some of you, these are people that you work with. You're going to distance yourself from some people that you work with for some of you because you're understanding that they don't have your best interest in mind. For some of you, these people wanted you reprimanded. These are the type of people, for example, Spirit's giving us. I used to be uh, close to a co-worker. Um, this was when I worked with Verizon. This person was so secretly envious. This person wanted my spot. Um... But I didn't see it that way at that time. I helped this person move 011111, 011111. All of these people, five people could be significant. Everyone's going to go their separate ways. Everyone's going to go their separate ways. Um, I helped this person move. I helped this person, like whatever I could do. Um, I was I was in a higher position than her. I would help train her. These people are all liars too. I would help train her. I would help do, I'm like, what do we gotta do to get you promoted? I'm in this special group for salespeople. I wanna get you into that. I wanna get you, this person would go secretly planning my fucking downfall. Even wanted me to hoe around with this man who had no fucking like interest in me, like not serious. This woman was like, just planting like evil seeds uh, every every little little um little deeds like she would do little things and i'm like something's off like something's off but i denied my fucking intuition not anymore but um for some of you someone even wants to be like they want you to be a little whore for some of you that's what's coming in this is the type of person they would something about comino this is something about yep there it is there it is there she is. You better feel the souls, my lovies. I don't care what the vessel looks like. You better feel the souls, my lovies. For some of you, you have some fake-ass friends who's really secretly angry. Bitter-ass, bitter, bitter whatever. She's coming up as a bitter itch. Mm -hmm. This person could talk a lot of shit about a lot of people with you. I don't care if this person gossips with you, gets you into all the fucking dramas. Someone that loves you will not get you into a whole bunch of fucking drama all the time. They just would not. They would not. In the long run, you're going to see this. In the long run, you're going to see this for some of you, that this person is really a queen of diamonds. In the long run, you're going to see. Because for some of you, you may be in denial. To be quite frank with you, my lovies, this is how it's coming in. Everything is coming in for a reason. I will never forget some co-workers. I gave a lot of a lot of energy, love, uh, um, something about secret service is coming in for some of you. I gave a lot of energy, love, promoting these people. Um, I want you to be promoted too. I want to grow with you. I had a boss tell me one time, I love you as a manager. And I'm like, why? He's like, you're so great at what you do because you really love these people. And I'm like, don't we all love each other? No. Uh-uh. No. 
No. In corporate settings, he that man was with the company for a while and he had seen some shit. So he was telling me he was shocked that I really this person could pretend that they fucking love you, my lovies. This bullshit. And you're gonna see it. It's bullshit. Mechanical love. You're going to see it. For some of you, you're not seeing it right now. But you're going to see how this sweetie pie to you is a fucking devil. And she doesn't like being called out. And she's fucking angry. I'm saying it for a reason. She doesn't like being called out. In her soul, this woman, if she were to meet me, like if I was in front of this person, she would hate me. She would hate me. She would look for a reason to hate me because energetically, I fucking see her. For some of you, you don't see her. For some of you, I see her. And she ha she hates you. She hates your joy too. She hates your happiness because a person pretends to be happy, but she's not, but you are. And for some of you, you don't match. You're trying to be best, best buddy, buddy, buddy with someone who is not your match. You think this person's a catch for some of you. You're the catch, not this person. Mm -mm. Fake ass love. I don't care if you fucking go to Timbuktu with this person. It's bullshit. It's bullshit, my lovies. I'm just a messenger here. Pick your friends wisely for some of you. Something about O'Reilly's. This person's going to talk to you about something they did to their vehicle. A BMW could be significant for some of you. A Cadillac could be significant for some of you. A Toyota could be significant for some of you. Something about a Tacoma is coming in as well. Being very cautious, my lovies, who you call your friends. They'll plan your demise secretly and try to take your spot. Envious competitive psychos. Bullies 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 everything is coming in for a reason my lovies everything is coming in for a reason they're looking to see what they can gain off of you for some of you you're a nine of pentacles energy you're very independent even if you are in a connection um for some of you you are in very independent energy you're very for some of you you could have some type of role where you work independently like you're not working like you don't have to really report to anybody or you feel really free in your life for some of you you have some type of gain for some of you you have a blessing coming in a uh, spirit has say, has said that for some of you cominos cominos for some of you lentils lentejas is coming in in spanish for some reason we got the number 25 that could be significant for some of you we got 1964 or 64 or 46 for some of you 52 for some of you cultivation profit and conclusion cultivation profit and conclusion you're concluding a cycle for some of you because i'm also getting the, the number nine the number seven is also here with this 25 so seven energy um luck is on your side surprises a surprise move or surprise travel for some of you cancer energy july could be very significant success coming in in july for some of you after something that you had prayed for for some of you you prayed for something you prayed for a gift for some of you you prayed for a completion of a cycle oh one sixteen thirty three you paid you paid you also paid for a completion of a cycle for some of you could be com uh, completing a certificate or some type of certification goodness humanness and morality for some of you you are moral for some of you don't allow the energies that you keep around you to tarnish your morality for some of you you have some type of stop here or someone's trying to stop your gains break pause and stagnation so there's a delay in a situation for some of you when it comes to a gain and real estate i told you this real estate energy has been present 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 for you my lovies the last few days or maybe the last week or so oh one seventeen eleven seven 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 um wealth investment and a mega project so you have a very important project that's happening for some of you but there's a pause in a situation or a stop to a situation for some of you seven seven energy for some of you the number 12 could be significant something can stop because of a 12 year old or a three year old a three year cycle could be significant for some of you we have some type of stop that's happening now someone was investing for some of you pears for some of you something about the restaurant industry because i'm getting like like poached pears and I told you, Spirit is going to give you a gift. I was feeling the gift. I'm like, watch, the gift is going to come out because I feel like a Spirit was showing it to us. We got a gift. You're getting a gift. For some of you, you could be redirected somewhere because you're going to get a gift of real estate. For some of you, it's like you're going to inherit something or there's going to be a gifted opportunity to work on a mega project somewhere else. Or for some of you, you could be getting some type of like huge investment here. Um, and it's going to make you put a stop to something else. For some of you, this is a gift. 
this overload energy has been very present for some of you you could be feeling overloaded but for some of you i feel for some of you, you're feeling a little bloated for some of you um you're feeling overloaded but or you're about to feel overloaded in a really good way because there's a mega project in your field and you're going to stop working independently for some of you or for some of you you know vice versa take it how it resonates either you're going from working very independently or solo on a situation you're going to stop that and you're going to work on a mega project for some of you you could still be very independent while working on a mega project or working on something bigger again i do feel like you have a big deal that you're closing but you're going there's an opposing force that's going to redirect you to work on an even bigger deal and you're maybe not going to see it this way you may even feel all olsen you may even townsend something about the fbi and prostitution like uh mk ultra stuff was coming in for some of you earlier today um you may even feel like insider you may even feel like insider magazine um you may even feel like i don't want to go work on this <laughs> but spirit needs you to like you were very happy independently minding your business you have to stop this and move to work on something else like it's a big project whatever it is is something that's it's a gift and spirit's gifting it to you you may be even a little stubborn to be quite frank the way it's coming in is like what's the problem my love like everything's good actually this is fucking great this is what you've always wanted to do but the number 36 could be significant for some of you this is a huge promotion a souvenir and delightful 79 could be significant for some of you you have a gift coming in but you're gonna be really 67 could be significant 76 but you're gonna be 36 63 7 yeah it's a rites of passage i told you you're going through an initiation i told you for some of you you're going through an initiation ceremony mystery and magic and it's an eternal thing it's an eternal love it's an eternal love my lovies eternity consistency and your soulmate you have something really great coming in. We're done. You've won. You won, my lovies. You've won. You've won, my lovies. You've won. You've won, my lovies. You've won. <laughs> it tickles. It tickles the pickle. For some of you, your tickle's gonna, your tickle's gonna be pickled. <laughs> something all pickle juice. For some of you, like pickle juice. <clears throat> For some of you, you tickle the pickle. For some of you, you're gonna tickle the pickle. For some of you, your pickle's gonna get tickled. <laughs> okay enough is enough <laughs> enough <laughs> you see i don't get red mallories but you're telling you're turning your sister friend red <laughs> it's like <laughs> tickle the pickle mallories what are you talking about <laughs> you're gonna tickle the pickle mallories you're gonna get your pickle tickled <laughs> <laughs> it's making my toes curl it's making my mouth water it's making me want to have a daughter for some of you triumph it feels so fucking good it feels so good. Again, you can't fake the energies when you feel them, when it's in the flow, my lovies. is the real deal, holy field. For some of you, you're the real deal, holy field. For some of you, sometimes the real deal, holy field. Okay, enough. Success, victory, and achievement. We're done. You've won. You've won, my lovies. You've won. Take what resonates, see what doesn't. That was beautiful. A beautiful ending. It made me hot. I mean, <laughs> anyways, my lovies, that was, that was have fun with all of that uh whatever is coming in for some of you you have a really successful wave coming and don't be scared don't be scared my lovies it's your soul's calling soulmate energy soulmate energy anyways my lovies stay well stay well stay absolutely well you know why my lovies a jeep because you're just a friend loves you and adores you loves you and adores you your spirit friends love you if you need a private read my lovies you can book in the description box below because we have collective energies here so just keep that in mind my lovies your sister friend loves you and adores you akia soul loves you and adores you spirit friends love you and adore you love you and adore you sister friend loves you people that lie to pretend like they have this type of energy your sister friend and and then it's creepy because on some level you can feel the lies i don't care how blind you want to be to lies on some level you feel them your sister friend loves you and adores you Something about Magnum condoms. Loves you and adores you. Your spirit friends love you and adore you. Love you and adore you. Your sister friend loves you. Something about Savage and adores you. Loves you and adores you. Your sister friend and your spirit friends. And your sister friend and your spirit friends. In love always, in love always, in love always. And forever, homies and Victor. Peace, my lovies.